Hey, this is Colleen Flanagan, mind, body, wisdom, expert, and master dowser. This video is about how to release your anger and to help those who love you because they don't want to see you angry and upset. As you know, anger can really mess up the digestive tract, the urinary tract, your back, your muscles, your liver. It just eats away at your insides. And I had to know the voice of experience is talking here. So we'll do a very brief clearing. If you have some specific things you're angry about, just write them down so you don't forget any. And otherwise, we'll just do a a general clearing. And anything that comes up, write that down too, okay? So what we're going to do is uh, my standard form of clearing is to clear the energy of the governing vessel meridian that runs from the bottom of your torso all the way along the spine. And it ends up underneath your nose. And if you're a dowser like I am... You can douse for what is the level of your anger. Like I just started doing that (laughs) this morning and my anger is at level eight. So I definitely got some work to do here. So let's get started as you either tap under your nose or run your hand in an arc according to the diagrams on the screen. You're going to be able to talk about what you're angry about and, and the state that you're releasing it. So let's get started. I now let go of this huge anger inside of me about what's happening in the world today, what happened to my mom. I let go of my anger from all past sweethearts who did me wrong, friends who hurt me, co-workers, bosses. I let go of my anger from childhood, from all the terrible things that happened in my childhood. I release my anger at family members. I let go of my anger at world leaders and politicians for just screwing up the world. And as I let go of this anger, my body feels safe to heal. The inflammation in my body goes down and I feel happier, healthier, and more energized because I acknowledge that anger will drain your health and it will also drain your energy. And ain't nobody want that because we need all the health and energy we can get nowadays. So just take a nice deep breath in and out. And if you have anything else that came up that you felt angry about, just keep letting it go. Um, If you're in public and you're getting angry, you can just tap under your nose and uh, just in your mind, just say, I now let go of this anger about seeing something or remembering something. I've been hearing some famous people say, we got to stay angry. We got to get active. I don't believe in staying angry. I do believe in activism. And sometimes when you take action, even doing animal rescue stuff like I've done or helping people heal and for volunteer work, you feel good about taking action. You don't need to be angry to get that done. So thank you so much for watching. Take care of your sweet self. Know that you are a treasure on this planet and you are needed or your contribution to the world. Check out my website, emorescue.com, for more free stuff to help you along your healing path. Namaste. Peace out.